All right, hello everyone, my name is Michelle, and uh, I have one of these delightful little remote control dogs. That is a replica, it's a one quarter size replica of K9 from Doctor Who. It was made by Character Options, it's officially licensed uh, piece of merchandise, and um, it's been discontinued. So the price for those has gone up quite a bit since I purchased mine, and so of course, um, what I've done is disassembled it and taken it apart. Because that's, I guess that's what you do. I've decided to hack the toy. It was a reasonably well-engineered uh, uh, um, tech piece of technology, and it, and it worked pretty good. But um, you couldn't really have a very robust conversation with him. And what's the point of having a robot dog if you can't have you know, an, an actual conversation with him. So I've decided to replace his ele internal electronics with Arduinos and um, a wave shield and a motor shield. So here you see uh, is the base for the actual toy, and there's the two motors and the front wheels along with a gearbox. And then uh, there's that's where the batteries go. It runs on a couple of uh, AA batteries. And then this is housing for a free-spinning uh, caster wheel in the back. So it's front-wheel drive, and then the back just falls along uh, as best it can, which makes uh, driving it a little hinky, but after you get used to it, it's fine. And then he also has a little built-in speaker. So you can see here, there is the Arduino on the bottom and the Wave Shield from Adafruit on the top, along with an SD card uh, that is positively chuck to the gills with um, voiceover uh, that has been provided by Dale, uh, who is a delightful gentleman who does a wonderful canine voice. And here is my tremendously awesome wiring job. So we're going to test this out. Um, he doesn't have a body right now, much to the distress of some of my friends at ATX Hackerspace, but uh, he does have a voice box, so he should, in theory, be able to talk. Uh, and that's what we're going to try to do now. So, hey, K9, uh, I, I apologize for the fact that you don't currently have a body, but uh, why don't you uh, bark or something so we can test out your voice? I Well, okay, but, you know, you're, you're very advanced. You're from the year 5000, K9. Why, why don't you just give it a try? All right. Um, I'm sorry I asked, quite frankly. Apologies are unnecessary. Okay. Well, we can work through that. That's fine. Well, why don't you uh, tell the folks um, watching on their computers, wherever they may be, a little bit about yourself? K9? K9? What are you doing? Updating Facebook. Okay. Um... I can see that I've got a lot of work ahead of me to sort of refine this build out. Allow me to download a PDF of the K9 user's manual for you. Oh, wait, nobody ever wrote one. Well, isn't that just peachy?